Hello, and today I'm going to be showing you how to fix the rank error with multiplayer when you go to join a game. You get this 57.475 error, which I'm about to get. Well, let's find a quick match, hopefully. There we go. Well, anyway, for this you're going to need Cheat Engine, Black Ops 2, obviously, um, well, if you are a member of MPGH, please thank the topic, uh, down here, so, store crashed, what does that? Thank the topic. There we go. So in here, five fifty-seven thousand four hundred and seventy-five error. You keep getting it because your XP is like fucked up down here. So here you want to install Cheat Engine. CheatEngine.org link will be in the description. You want to hit this scan process list button icon, whatever. Scroll near the bottom where you have Steam and it should see the Black Ops 2 icon and the exe t6mp.exe. Open it up and you want to hit, bef you don't want to scan anything, just screw things up where it won't, but it doesn't matter. Hit ad add address manually. Type in the following address. Type in rank. You don't have to do it. Make sure the type is four bytes. And you're gonna max it out with the one on the topic, and it'll also be a copy in the description. Uh, okay. Uh, over here, you should see the 55 icon. You want to press EX and go back. You should see barracks as new. Well, it always says new for me anyway. I want to hit prestige mode, learn more, and then enter your prestige. Go over to prestige awards and hit fresh start. Use fresh start, yes. This will also unlock the, the player card, the rubber, which is really good. I think that's the only thing you get to keep in DLCs. Well, I haven't purchased any of these, I'll be showing you how to get these in a later video, but let's get back to the business at hand. Mm. Yeah. Now if I go find a public match. Uh, how about this? Random shite. Random players just choose a match like normally and join the game and get one kill. But this will reset you, all your stats will be gone or not. Sadly, it was your fault for using the rank card, the repercussions were told onto the form and if it wasn't, go route him, not me. This is just a fixed video. Once you've fixed the damn thing, wait for the ga damn game to load, get one, kill it and back out. You stay in the game if you want, but I'm just gonna back out. And the net. And. <sighs> bored out of my nut, bored out of my nut, bored out of my nut, bored out of my fucking skull. My god, start already. I'm not playing this right now. Well, anyway, you should see black screens now, and you should see the map, and you'll be able to play. It. That is a, it's a very simple tutorial, and if you didn't um, understand it, I'll go over it in a second. Again, okay. Yeah. Get 
Okay, kill or kill yourself, whatever. Uh, you don't have to leave the game, but I am. Okay, now cool. Living. Your parts will be fixed, everything. Sadly, all your shit will be gone. So, anyway, about the peacekeeper. This is how you get it before the patch. This will give you other map pack DLCs. This works on game. Proof of that will be in a second. Proof that the game, the peacemaker isn't out yet. Revolution. See so you people in this category. You just sit there for ages searching for a game until the update is released. So, Nuketown, you can get that for free. But if you go on end these, we call DLC. You don't have any of these maps, so it'll crash. So, anyway, you only have Nuketown. You want to start your game. But this is what I'm showing you about the freaking peacekeeper that works perfect. Everything works about it. And come on. Okay, let's just go over the simple steps. Anyway, that's going to be spawned in a second now. Open up, add the dress manually, type the lesson. God damn it. No idea what happened there. That is not gonna break my video, but for purposes. For educational purposes, I'm just gonna. Wait, here we go. Online. Hi, right. barracks isn't fucked up anymore. Good. My computer's been slow recently. And it decides to fuck up on me. God damn you, alright. Uh, Please keep your store there. I recently used a wee XP hack thinking I could get all the camels, yay. But the repercussions was it was I will say not two seconds after they updated the game. Bollocks to me. Oh well, so basically I fucked when it happened and Just had to do this and searched a while, stressed out with my head, and found this. So I'm uploading this to you so you don't get stressed out your head. Worry like a wee bitch. And so as you can see, Peacekeeper works perfectly. This will be my next video showing you how to do it, or in this video, I don't know. Anyway, I will be giving you the download link for the um, Peacekeeper and all that, even before the release. Alright. The game is the end of this video. Well, not this video, but the tutorial. Okay, now. The link for the installer will be in the description. Simple, you just... I don't want to actually run an installer. Simply just want to hit next and it will not install into your Steam directory, but don't worry. But you will have to close Steam's process while installing. And after you've installed, you want to just make sure Steam is closed and go to your desktop, make sure it's the uh, screen Steam icon, make sure Steam is still closed, click on it, log in, you should see a, you should see like your game, only your games and your, or 
your games, you want to close it and restart it and then you shall see 